Our universe holds more mysteries than all the Sherlock Holmes and Agatha Christie stories put together. Every day, astronomers discover new entities, highlighting the infiniteness of space. The James Webb Space Telescope has played an important role in unraveling the secrets of the depth of the cosmos. Welcome to Lab 360, it's time to explore. Recently, in a groundbreaking discovery, the astronomers using the JWST discovered a burger-shaped, planet-forming material around a young star. This delicious discovery proved that we can have a McDonald's in space too. Nah, we're kidding. This find by the JWST's Ice Age team, resulted in the creation of the first-ever detailed 2D inventory of ice within a star, which was made of similar material from which our solar system emerged around 4.5 billion years ago. This astonishing investigation on the ice within the planet's disk will provide us with crucial data for studying and understanding our Earth's history as well as that of the other planets in our solar system. The ice is made of atoms of elements like carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, and nitrogen. These elements are crucial for the formation of molecular building blocks of life. However, the study of these ice formations is vastly limited due to the constraints of Earth's atmosphere which has water-like material which affects the ground telescopes as they are small in size to detect these small targets. The JWST is larger in size and quells these challenges effectively. This investigation into the ice within a planet-forming disk will furnish crucial data for studies, enhancing our understanding of Earth's history, as well as that of other planets, our solar system, and the stars surrounding us. The star named as HH48NE by the astronomers is in a traversing mode with the planet-like disk towards the space telescope. The star is nearly 600 light-years away from the Earth. You can imagine how many millions of kilometers the actual distance is. It lies in the southern constellation and resembles a hamburger. Which means there won't be any shortage of burgers in the celestial branch of McDonald's. It has a dark, central lane and two bright buns, due to its edge-on perspective. On its way to the telescope, the star's light interacts with various molecules inside the disk, which generates an absorption spectrum with peaks which are unique to each molecule. Thus, very little light reaches the telescope, especially from the most dense part of the disk in the dark lane. The JWST's heightened sensitivity compensates for this by overcoming the limitations of other telescopes. The astronomers have identified the distinct peaks of watery ice, carbon dioxide ice also known as dry ice, and carbon monoxide ice in the absorption spectrum. Additionally, the evidence of ice containing ammonia, cyanate, carbonyl sulfide, and heavy carbon dioxide has been observed. Imagine the amount of carbon existing in the atmosphere there. This team intends to dig deeper into the spectrum of the same planet-forming disk in the future, thus extending their observations to other such similar entities. These discoveries of carbon monoxide mixtures may change our present understanding of the planetary compositions, potentially leading to the identification of carbon-rich planets located closer to the stars. This discovery not only satisfies our curiosity about the cosmos but also propels our thirst for knowledge to another level. Do you think that there is life beyond Earth? Do you think life can sustain entities like these? Share your thoughts in the comments section and be sure to subscribe to Lab360 for the latest revelations in universe exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated, and let's continue to explore together.